Lots of rain a little while ago, and now suddenly we saw some blue what skies storm? there. What yeah, storm? Exactly. I know, no, it's, yeah, it's beautiful. The, the, the first couple waves of the storm have moved through uh, the Wasatch Front, and we're seeing more of that moving into southwest Wyoming. Still a lot of rain coming down in central and southern Utah, and there is more thunderstorm activity headed towards northern Utah, the Wasatch Front as well. We'll get to that in a second. Just a textbook setup right now as far as a, a monsoon type pattern here in the desert southwest. Now again, monsoon is not heavy rainfall. Monsoon is a seasonal shift in winds, but a seasonal shift in winds here in the desert southwest means the winds start coming from the south. And when they come from the south and we get this sort of a setup here where we have a high pressure off of southeast Utah, we have a low pressure in the Pacific Northwest. Look at how that's just pulling moisture all the way from the Gulf of Mexico, all the way from the Gulf of California, all of that coming up uh, into uh, into the desert southwest and that's why we get these afternoon thunderstorms now today's they were a little bit earlier than what we would typically see and what we, we you know, referred to as a monsoon pattern. But that's because we had a little storm system that was rolling through the state that helped organize the storms and fire off those first couple bands of thunderstorms that moved through uh, a good portion of the state. Now, again, a lot of activity still in central and southern Utah. These are more typical monsoon type storms that we see or with the monsoon pattern that we see in the state of Utah. Again, lifting from the southwest, moving towards northern Utah, very heavy rain. We have all those flash flood warnings in effect for south southwestern Utah and some of that heavy rain again will be working its way. It's a few hours away. We're talking four to five hours from now, but that will be moving across the Wasatch Front and we will be seeing a chance of thunderstorms developing later on this evening once again. Temperatures right now, low 70s along the Wasatch Front. So again, these storms push through. They drop the temps by 20 or so degrees, and it feels really nice, although pretty humid. Uh, you can see, there's a look at the 24-hour temperature change. So from yesterday, where we didn't have thunderstorms, to today with those thunderstorms that rolled through, again, big cool down when compared to uh, yesterday at this time. Okay, so the storms will push through later on this evening and then die out. We get into tomorrow afternoon. Everything fires up once again. Widespread thunderstorms, uh, heavy precipitation expected again tomorrow. Not quite as widespread on Monday afternoon, but still storms developing. And by Tuesday, it moves more towards eastern Utah, becomes more isolated uh, by Tuesday, Wednesday. But then possibly by Thursday, Friday, we see a return of these thunderstorms again across the entire state. So look for afternoon storms to develop uh, in central Utah, southern Utah as well. We'll have, a, we'll have sunshine in the morning, clouds in the afternoon, thunderstorms in the afternoon and the evening. You can see our highs in the 70s, 80s and triple digits around St. George. 102, 104, we do cool it down into the 90s as we get towards the middle and latter half of the week. Okay, northern Utah and surrounding areas again. Uh, lots of sunshine in the morning and then developing clouds and thunderstorms in the afternoon, about 90 in Logan, 90 in Spanish Fork as well here along the Wasatch Front, mid-90s in Salt Lake for an afternoon high uh, with those uh, thunderstorms developing. Okay. We'll keep that pattern in place on Monday, not quite as widespread. Again, slightly drier Tuesday, Wednesday. Most of that activity will move into eastern Utah for Tuesday, Wednesday, but it does look like by Thursday, Friday, we could see a return of this pattern once again. So, All right, so a lot tomorrow, a lot like today, where you kind of yes. have the sunshine Tomorrow's and then all of a sudden the storms. Okay. Busy day tomorrow. All right, sure. thanks a lot, Brad. Yep. Well, have you seen it?